Wolves. What are they? Where did they come from? Do they really exist? People find themselves asking such questions every day around the globe, and Kalamazoo College is no exception. Intent on educating the public, Wolf Awareness Week was established in 1996 to better raise awareness of wolves. On October 16th through 22nd of 2011, Wolf Awareness Week came to Kalamazoo College. But was it enough? Are students really aware? We ask students around campus. You may find the answer shocking. When I was little, I used to believe in wolves. No, I'm not too sure. I mean, I haven't really seen any. I think I know what wolves are. They have feathers and wings and claws, I think. Wolves? They're freaking scary, man. The Hindenburg? Wolves. Well, I think wolves did exist, but I mean, that was probably like millions of years ago. I mean, they've been extinct for ages. A wolf killed my father. I, I mean, I didn't see it happen, but I'm pretty sure it was a wolf. Oh, they do great things. I heard Neil Armstrong was a wolf, the one who rode all those bikes. Wolves are a fairy tale, like unicorns. JFK assassination? Wolves. There's pretty extensive fossil record of all their different types of species. There are plant eater wolves and uh, meat eater wolves, some with big necks that would pick up in the trees to get uh, high fruit and stuff. They're bad news, man. They're bad news. Lots of people have said they've seen wolves, and I've heard a lot of people see, say that they've seen them like... It is clear that the general Kalamazoo student body has little concept of wolf awareness. Not one student brought up the issue of wolves on campus, around town, or any of Kay's numerous wolf alums. Well, if you look at this map of yeah. the city... <clears throat> well, if you look at this map of Kalamazoo and the greater surrounding area, there have been a lot of wolf sightings in on the college campus, but also in the nearby cemetery. I think they're mostly coming from Portage, possibly as far as Grand Rapids, but it's really hard to tell at this time. Wolves are elusive creatures. Wolf sightings are rare, and only grow rarer as the days pass. Thousands of wolves go unnoticed each day, and that's only counting the ones we know about. The number one threat to the Kalamazoo wolf is a lack of awareness. Should the population not learn to see and appreciate the wolves in their lives, they just might disappear. They just might. Maybe. I mean, I've always wanted to believe in wolves, but it's so hard because they're never really around. If I could just see a wolf once before I die, then I'd really be happy.